Hello everyone and welcome to the PJ Mask headquarters at Toy Fair 2017. We are very excited to share with you some of the latest and greatest uh, in the line. Uh, starting with our PJ Mask Rival Racers track playset. It comes with one exclusive Catboy vehicle and, an, uh, and a removable Catboy figure. It also comes with, uh, and hence the name Rival Racers, a ninja school bus, night ninja school bus, uh, that you can compete against. So both you and a friend will be able to launch over two different launchers and race around the track um, at the same time or independently. So I'm going to show you first the Catboy launcher. Oh, and we went off the tracks. Let's try that one more time, folks. That's the beauty of this. So you can see on that second try, Catboy went around the loop-de-loop, -loop, around the corner, and through the alleyway, and ran right past Luna Girl, uh, which popped up there. So we'll reset Luna Girl. And then the other fun part of this is some lamp, uh, ramp launching action. So we're going to launch Night Ninja through the museum doors, past the Ninjalinos, and through the back rampway. So that'll be coming this fall. We're very excited about that. We also have some excitement Throughout the vehicle line, uh, we have some new characters, Night Ninja as well as Romeo in the miniature vehicles. You can see uh, that lots of detail around even at this uh, lower price point, so we're really excited about both of those characters. And it'll allow kids to play out again the hero versus villain play. Um, this spring we launched the, the deluxe vehicles, uh, which are out in stores now. These are a little bit of a higher price point to allow for lights and sounds. Um, there's moving mouth on the Catboy car, wings pop out and flap on the Deluxe Owl Glider, and Gecko Mobile's tail obviously wags back and forth like it should. Um, and then in the main vehicles, uh, you can see we've launched with uh, Catboy, Owlet, and Gecko, but new for this season are Romeo's Lab as well as Night Ninja. And you can see them staged there with plenty of room for both the heroes and the villains uh, because obviously with kids and creative play, they're going to play with it as they will. But again, part of the key here is that it allows for the imagination for the children to play with um, both the heroes as well as the villains and kind of come up with their own, their own storylines around these great characters. And finally, we're just creeping past the Deluxe Headquarters playset that was nominated for Toy of the Year this past, uh, past year, last night. Um, and then moving into the figures, uh, we have a, a broad range here, everything from articulated figures that are posable. Um, you can see here Catboy, Owlette, and Gecko, as well as Luna Girl. Um, and then to add to the fun, uh, in the top there, we've added a whole new deluxe collectible set that includes some pet friends um, and what's really exciting you can see even the ninjalinos so again this will allow for for creativity and story building um, throughout the play process um, another really ex exciting item here that's built around transformative play is um, right here you can see that this is includes they're each sold separately and includes outlet you can buy catboy or gecko and when you turn each piece, the heroes turn from their daytime personas to their nighttime personas. And what's really fun about this is if you buy each one for um, Owlette, Gecko, and Catboy, all three of the pieces will turn. And then you'll be able to do all the transformations at once, just like in the show. We have also at a six inch scale, our talking figures. Uh, we have Catboy, Owlette, uh, and we do have Gecko, which is now pictured here. But what's new and exciting are the villains once again. We have Night Ninja, Romeo, and Luna Girl. And that concludes this year's tour around the PJ Masks headquarters. I uh, hope to see you back again next year. And to end things off, we're going to go out with a bang here and uh, try to see if we can double up on both the launchers. Ooh, and Night Ninja was foiled by Luna Girl. See, that's all part of the fun and action in the PJ Mass line. Hope to see you soon.